going to talk to you a little bit today about the different haptic body suits that we have. Uh, as you can see, we have the Tesla suit here on the right, and we have the B Haptics Tactrox suit over on the left that we actually experienced both of these at CES. You can't really compare and contrast them because they're meant for very different markets. Uh, this suit actually has EMS and TENS, so muscular stimulation as well as nerve stimulation. You can feel things like wind and rain, as well as it has biometrics to actually understand that it's Seth wearing it, uh, as well as he's measuring things like his heart rate. It also has motion sensor capture, so that you can detect your movements whilst in VR or non-VR experiences where you just need to be tracking your body. This suit is more intended for gaming. One of the really cool things about it, it can actually work off of audio alone. So you can put this on and based off of the base experiences and possibly other experiences in the audio track you have, you can get those sensations back. It also has its own SDK, similar to the Tesla suit. So we can develop particular sensations for it based off of the experience we're going in. Let's say, for example, we have an experience where something will bash into his belly we'll be able to simulate that, that feeling. Uh, we're going to do some more in-depth testing of it to know exactly where the pros and cons are for the commercial uses, but straight out of the gate, consumer and some commercial, mostly commercial, high-end training, very as close to realistic as you can get. I would even guess that something like this could be used during maybe even mixing music for producers and things like that. You want to feel the sub, sub qualities of, of low end? Yeah, they're definitely both really valuable pieces of hardware that work really well with virtual reality and we're totally ecstatic to work with them. And yeah, we're going to be developing solutions for, for both these great suits and much more hardware. So be sure that you are subscribed and we will see you the next time around that we're checking out something really cool like this.